Hi, I'm Clyde and welcome to Basic Works. Today we are installing the Ready Shade Easy Lift Room Darkening Model. Don't forget, hit the like and subscribe. It'll keep you posted on what's going on. I've got more videos here on tools, projects, everything you need to do around the house. You'll notice there's a piece of a scale at both ends of the blind itself. Measure your window, say you got 26 inches. You cut it this 26 mark here, you flip it around, you cut it to 26 inch mark at the other end. Overall, your shade then is 25 and a half inches to give you a quarter of an inch clearance on both sides between the edge of the shade and the window sill. It's calculated in on this scale. That's what this is all about. Remember when you buy these, when they're new, before you cut them and everything, you take these end caps out before you cut this side and then you cut it and then you put this end cap right back in. It makes a nice finished end. 29 and an eighth is what I'm after. So I'm gonna go to this 29 and one eighth mark here. And you can't see through this plastic guard very well that they give you. So I'm gonna make a mark now with that off. Cut through that plastic using this little coping saw. I'm gonna use a razor blade knife to cut through the paper part. The same thing on this side of it. It cut through each layer of the paper. We go back to the coping saw for the plastic. We removed this end cap before we started on this. Now we just take that end cap and we're gonna slide it right back in there. Now we have this side cut. We flip it around, we cut at the same mark on the other end exactly the same way. The razor blade did a nice job of cutting a clean edge. The inside of this honeycomb is coated with a uh, silvery material, almost like a silver paint, probably reflective to some degree, which helps the room darkening ability of this. So I removed the backing from the double-sided tape. I'm gonna angle this into position in my example here, I, I put a piece of uh, quarter inch wood here in my window frame, just because I don't like the idea of putting glue or sticky tape or anything onto my window frame. So I'm just gonna glue it onto this piece of wood I added. Now I'm just gonna center this up side to side and give myself plenty of room there and push it up against my piece of wood here the whole way along to make sure it sticks good. It seems like it's adhered pretty well. It doesn't look like it's coming loose or anything. It's a sunny day today. There's a lot of light, but when I pull this down, it's definitely blocking all that light. And if you look at the blind, it doesn't look as white as the piece of printer paper. And like I said, that didn't bother me because I'm, I wasn't looking for pure white because as you can see, my walls are a little bit of a beige color. If you put them up, expecting them to be as white as a piece of printer paper, mm, probably not. So you can just lift this by the center and raise it to whatever height you want and stop, and it stays there. There's no buttons, no strings, n nothing. You just pull it to bring it down to whatever height you want. And it, it raises and lowers very nicely i don't have a problem with that at all this ready shade easy lift is the room darkening model and it does a very good job there's no light now coming in on the desks or the computer monitors it has solved that whole problem i like it